Good morning, everyone. So last night I brought in uh, an E46. It's an 01 330i that needs a transmission. Uh, I believe you guys saw this actual car uh, last vlog where I was test driving it to see how bad the transmission was and it was clunking really bad and all that. So we finally brought that in. I pulled the transmission off last night. Now we're gonna continue working on it. We're gonna go ahead and put the new transmission in and just button everything back up. And then we also have to do the oil pan gasket, uh, control arms, the control arm bushings, and tie rods. So let's go ahead and get it all done. Let's go. All right, so the transmission's in, the new one's in. Uh, I've hooked up the drive shaft, exhaust, all that stuff's good to go. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lower the car, put my engine support bar on the top, drop the front subframe with the power steering rack and all that so I can change out the oil pan gasket. Breaking off. Wow. It's bad.
So I know yesterday I was working on that transmission swap. Uh, I finished that car up, I forgot to end the vlog. Uh, it was pretty late when I was done. But now, uh, I'm about to bring in another car today. It's the day before 4th of July, we're still working. I think we're gonna stop working tomorrow. Uh, we also have a few other things planned for today. And you guys gotta stay tuned for that. He, his, his wagon is ridiculously clean. It's got, he bought it when it had 30,000 miles. Now it's at 109. I would love to buy it off of him. And I, he even made me a, an offer that's actually really good for the car. But it's still a little too high because it is so clean. And I feel bad for you know trying to lowball him. So we're just gonna pass on this one and just let it stay living. Cause whatever wagon we get, we're gonna end up doing a lot of stuff to it. And this one is so clean that there's no point of you know, start tearing it apart. And it's also an XI, and I don't want an XI. All right, so someone just sent me an address. Let's go see where, 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 that, where that takes us to. Those flops, man. Mm-mm-mm. the dipstick and literally no oil in it uh, oh no all right we're taking it for a test drive the tint is horrible and it needs an engine mount it barely got any oil in it it's rusting on the front pillar this is a part for some reason. The airbag blew right here. This door panel is not even on all the way. Yeah. This is not a big issue. We can always replace this. Alignment's way off. All right, so officially ours. Meet our new addition to the family. Let's hope it doesn't break down on the way to the shop. <laughs> oh my God, they're pretty sketchy. Yeah. But it's all right. We know how to work on them, so. Okay, so this seat doesn't move up, so how am I supposed to? Oh shit. To? Here, let's try it. Alright, let's go. No check engine lights, so that's really weird. Who knows, they probably erased it, but we'll figure it out. We are crazy. Alright, let's get ready to roll. We move forward. This is so crazy, you guys. So we're back at the shop. It drove good. Can't believe we bought it. <laughs> for a second, I thought we weren't. Yeah. We got it for twenty-seven fifty, more than what I wanted to spend on it because it does need a, a little bit of work. Uh, it has had body work done, but it matched everything matches for the most part. There's no frame damage or any of that. But we can fix everything, so it doesn't really matter. We finally got the wagon, and it's white, and it's pre facelift. Oh man. And it's not an XI. Nope. And it's not a three twenty-three. It's awesome. We don't see no clear coat peeling, nothing. And I mean, we have all the parts to fix it, like the interior things. I'm just driving, but it's gonna need a new windshield. And this is the only part that I don't like, the rust that's right here. Yeah, they try to cover it up. So it started bubbling. Yeah. Um, and then here, there's a crack in the windshield. I mean, it's not bad. There's but... one more chip on that side too. No. It's gonna keep getting worse, but that's not a big deal. Right now he's about to work on this Subaru that a customer dropped off in the morning. He's doing the brakes and rotors.
So I just got done with the Subaru. Uh, the customer already picked it up. It was all good to go. The brakes were amazing. I highly recommend, if you guys have any imports, Akibono brakes, man, they're, they're freaking amazing. And Beamers, stick with Zimmerman or Techstar. But anyways, that's it for this vlog. Uh, stay tuned for the next vlog where I finish working on that wagon as well as I start working on the new wagon.